Are you looking to create more video in your business, but you don't have the budget to go out and buy all this extra equipment? Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you what you can do with what you have, your smartphone. Let's get into this video. Hi, my name is Jason Kruger and I help heart-centered businesses build and automate their online marketing systems. So you want to create more video in your business, but you don't have the budget to go out and buy these fancy cameras, the lenses, uh, the PC, and all this other stuff that you've seen online. So I thought I would create uh, a video to show you what you can do with just your smartphone. Now, if you haven't already seen, I'm actually recording this video on my smartphone. And the only other bits of equipment that I have is a Lavalier mic uh, plugged directly into my iPhone. And that's all I'm using to actually record the video. Now, there are a few extra things that I've added into this little production. I'm actually currently on holiday, um, and I thought this was the, probably the best time to actually record this video to show you that you can actually create a kind of studio environment wherever you go. So it doesn't really matter your location. So as I've said, I'm now recording this on my iPhone uh, with a Lavalier mic. And the only other extra bits that I have is I've got uh, some newer lights behind me here. If I can over there, and there's another one just down here. Uh, and all that is doing is creating a bit more atmosphere behind me because what you want to still do is create a nice background for for people when you are creating a video and you can do this with some cheap lighting now these newer lights that I, I bought are only about 40 pounds and they're USB so you can just plug them uh, directly into the wall with a, a, an adapter I've actually got these connected up to a battery pack because it's something that I carry around with me when I'm traveling uh, just to make sure that my phone etc is charged so I just have those plugged in. It just gives me a little bit more versatility uh, with positioning. So I'm not kind of a slave to where the uh, plugs are, but it's not something that you need. Uh, but as I said, I've got these lights just to uh, light up the background um, and create a bit more of an atmosphere. The only other thing that I have is another uh, LCD panel just above here, just to give me a little bit more light uh, on me. My camera or my iPhone is mounted on a tripod uh, with an iPhone holder. And again, these aren't very expensive. They're actually the cheapest ones I could find on Amazon. And I will post a link to all the equipment that I'm using to create this uh, video uh, in the description if you want to take a look at that. But that's all I've got in this production. I'm sat actually in this little uh, apartment uh, the lounges behind me, you can see the TVs here. I'm actually sat at the little table in the kitchen. So I'm not, it's not a massive space, uh, but I'm still able to record this video and still have it look pretty, pretty good. So please don't make the mistake of not creating video because you say, well, I don't have the fancy equipment. Now you can use that if you have that in your budget. Now I will post another link to another video that I, I did uh, where I actually go through the equipment that I'm using in my actual studio setup, but that is very expensive to set up. And if you don't have uh, that kind of budget, then all you need is your iPhone. When you're recording videos like this, do make sure that you are using a, a tripod uh, because then it, it allows you just to be free and there's not much shaking going on. But saying that, you do have people doing vlogs and all they've got uh, equipment wise is possibly a lovelier mic connected to the iPhone on a selfie stick and that's all they're using. When recording video on your iPhone, the only other settings that I would actually change on, on the iPhone is to make sure that you are recording in HD, so 1080, and that you've set the frame rate to 60 frames per second as this just creates a much smoother video um, and it does look so much better than just 30 frames per second. So make sure you go into your settings and change uh, the format of, of the videos that your iPhone is taking um, and change it to 1080 uh, and 60 frames 
per second. If you're not using an iPhone, I'm sure you can still change those. Unfortunately, I'm an iPhone user, so um, I don't know the Android operating system, but you might just need to Google that to, just to double check, but I'm sure that you'll be able to change um, the quality, the resolution, uh, and the frame rates that you're recording at. So you can be creative in what you use to create these videos. You don't need the whole fancy equipment. So please, if you like uh, what you've uh, seen in this video, please give the channel a subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you get notified when I next create a video. I am actually uh, recording uh, a behind the scenes video as I'm recording this using my Canon M50. And all I have on that is a little shotgun mic so that I'm catching some audio in that video as well. And I will be posting that one um, as well so that you can actually see the setup with uh, the iPhone. So you can uh, have a look and, and see how I've set that up. When you're recording videos, um, if you're going to go live, I wouldn't um, recommend the Canon M50. Uh, because it just doesn't have the clean HDMI and there's a lot of other hacks that you need to do to make it uh, work for live streaming. But if you're just going to do kind of pre-recorded videos, then the Canon M50 uh, works very well. Um, I, I had it before I really got much into to video. Uh, so it's a camera that I've always had, um, but now I'm using it to record uh, more behind the scenes footage, uh, etc. Uh, you'll see on the other video of my studio setup, the camera that I actually recommend is the Sony a6100. And that's because those cameras out of the box um, are set up for live streaming. So they have the clean HDMI uh, and it just works out of the box without any other hacks. But if you want to uh, look at that kind of setup, then click um, on the link either in this just in the description or uh, one of the cards just above uh, so you can go and watch that so i hope you enjoyed this video as you can see it's a very simple setup but it is very uh, effective and i will post all the equipment that i'm using in the description below so i hope to see you on the next one